today we're going to do a test of written language. Um, open your answer booklet to the section marked story and I want you to read the directions silently. You got them here? Alright, I'm going to read them for you here. Look at the three pictures below and make up a good story to go with them. Take about five minutes to think about your story. Be sure to write a complete story using all three pictures. It is best to plan a whole story before you begin to write. Okay. I want you to now do a little brainstorming here. Think about um, the pictures and think about what you can write for a few moments. Okay, now that you've had time to look at the pictures and think of something to write, you may take your pencil and begin to write your story. Good start there, you get a good start. Alright, find the section in the answer booklet labeled spelling. Read the following instructions silently. Write the words you hear in the space below. Try to spell each word correctly. Be sure to write or print neatly. Okay, now I'm going to read these words to you. And as I read them, I'm going to give you the word. And I'm going to say the sentence. And I'm going to say the word again. And you spell it correctly in the answer spaces. All right, number one. Left. Turn left at the corner. Left. Alright. Number two. When. We ate. When we were hungry. When. Number three. Spend. Did you spend the money? Spend. Number four. Storm. The storm passed quickly. Storm. Number five. Strong. The man was very strong. Strong. Number six. Shake. Did the baby shake the rattle? Shake. Number seven. New. Kathy knew the right answer. Knew. Number eight. Music. We heard the music on the radio. Music. Number nine. Eight. The boys had eight books. Eight. Number ten. Forty. He is 40 years old. 40. Number 11. Sure. Be sure to write the letter. Sure. Number 12. Tardy. 
Alan was tardy for school. Tardy. Number 13. Signal. The cars stopped at the traffic signal. Signal. Number 14. Section. The farmers worked one section of the land. Section. Number 15. Enough. Joan had enough to eat. Enough. 